Hey, what is going on, guys? I'm back. I told you I needed a break, and I took a break. Your boy is back. I'm refreshed. I'm showered. I ate, and we're back. So, we're back. It's been a while since I tapped into some Smash stuff. Um, so apparently, somebody made a Jiggle Physics from uh prior and from uh, Xenoblade Chronicles two. And the community, are, it's kind of balanced. People are, are upset. And people are loving it. Peep the bucket hat year. Also, Corey. Corey extension, bro. Boy, just hit 9 mil today, man. Oh, I'm so happy. But it's, it sucks, though. Because I was just like, you know, it's kind of stepping off a little bit. I, I've been watching it for like two years. I only watched it for like two years, bro. It sucks that, you know, Corey's going to be retiring soon, man. Dude's a great content creator. I love this, love this guy's work. And let's not get to that right now. You feel me? Because the boy going to start bark, start crying and all that. But yeah, I'm back. Um, so this guy, I, I guess he's going to rant about the whole thing. Man, me, I don't. Who cares? I feel like well, this was really pointless. I really, what's the point of making a 13 minute video about this? Like, who cares? Like, come on, man. It, uh, it's 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 a mod. Why are people getting mad about this shit? It's a mod. Who gives you some kid? I I, I want to see what I want to hear what this guy's about to say because it's stupid. I mean, like who? Cares? It's a mod. Wow. She has bounced by not guns. Who cares? Why is the internet so mad about this? Like, yo, are you kidding me? So and instead of uh, streaming, oh, I'm gosh, just, I'll just be right back. Hold on. All right, guys, I'm back. All right, so let's see. Recording it straight to YouTube. Uh, but I wanted to talk about something that's been going on for, the, like, the last couple weeks. Relating to Pyra and Mithra, the new Smash Brothers characters that Nintendo announced a while ago. I guess I'll start by explaining what happened. So Nintendo announced two new characters for Smash Brothers, Pyra and Mithra, from yep. Xenoblade. Well, hey, uh, just to put it frankly, they hype, gave though. them really big breasts, right? Which is uh, totally normal, or it's, like, an okay thing to do because that's just how some body types are. And that's okay. Some content creators made a, a whole lot of jokes about it, or they focused heavily uh, on the breasts and then uh, made, like, distasteful thumbnails or different things like that. Man, um, get your stick so out. A lot of get your stick out your butt, man. Upset, Gosh. Reasonably so. So then uh, said content creators, at least the ones that I know of, uh, apologized for it, kind of deleted the videos, and, and just took it more. mature approach to it uh, and i'll explain yo, the reasons yo, why yo, we're we're said a little later in the video <laughs> and now someone has made a mod with uh, the two characters having jiggle boob physics i'll hide the the twitter name just because i don't i'm not really trying to witch hunt someone but this is uh this is what they did uh, they just added jiggle physics uh they so they modded smash ultimate and they added jiggle physics to the boobs because that's totally necessary right that's something that we need to do Bro. Yo, uh, it's a joke, bro. Get the stick out your behind, dog. Look at you. Bro, I cannot believe he made a 14-minute video about this. Who cares? Who cares? It's jokes. I'm pretty sure the guy was joking. My um, gosh. Okay. So I'm going to talk about that and, like, what's stupid about it so what's wrong with it uh the first thing is that we actually do need to just stop objectifying women just straight up and, and i know some of you might be thinking well you know it's it's not a real woman it's a 2d woman so who cares what's the big deal well let me break this down for you in a, in a super simple way this handles that argument just very simply basically it's not as easy as just telling someone hey just stop objectifying women. And then they're like, okay, cool. The problem is that uh, we have a culture that supports that sort of thing. A culture that has been cultivated Yo. over decades, if not centuries, etc. All kinds of things go into it. But what I mean by culture is that like, you got your like shows in the 50s and TV shows in the 60s where right, it's just right. totally cool for the men on the shows to ogle the women mm -hmm. and objectify them and just looked them up and down and then it was just kind of funny or they thought it was great and and like you're just thinking well it's just a it's a tv show or it's just fiction but the thing is uh the more of that kind of stuff comes out in our media the more it, it propagates the idea that it's okay to do in real life and nobody can sit here and tell me 
that the objectification of women doesn't happen in real life. We all know that it does. Bro, and it's, it happens, bro, listen, right? that's just a, now, listen, you cannot compare that, you can't compare this to real life. You can't do it. All right, we live in a world today where we live with a bunch of a-holes. That's what the world we live in. There's a lot of, there's a good, there's a lot of good in this world, there's a lot of bad in this world, there's a lot of people that's always stand out kind of like in the middle. You're never going to be able to run away from that. You know, if girls being disrespected, people in general getting disrespected, we're never going to run away from that because that's just the kind of planet that we live in. You know, so if you tell one, if you can somehow to convince one person to stop doing this, stop doing this and that, there's going to be three other, five other more people doing other stupid stuff, doing other rude and not cool and disrespectful stuff. There's no changing that. That's never going to change. Well, because we live in an effed up society. That's never going to change. And the fact that you're making a comparison with this and to real life, dog, is pathetic. It's something I do not, I just disagree with, bro. I disagree with that completely. But I but see you what you're saying, though. That's the that thing. from what happens in uh, works of fiction. They're, they're all connected. The fact that our media is constantly okay with this sort of thing is what promotes that objectification in real life, right? So to say that, oh, you know, this is just a character in a video game, it doesn't mean that it happens in real life. No, bullshit. We've already seen it happen in real life because of the culture that's been created through all sorts of media. That Exactly. Up, you know, bro, there's no right? running away from um, that. So that's an easy response But this to is, isn't Another a big thing, bro. I wanted to add. This stuff right here doesn't cause that. This little baby stuff right here doesn't cause that. This is not the reason why. This little baby behind my... This is not the reason why, okay? There's way other different reasons on why this stuff this stuff happens. Was that some people have the argument that oh they're just appreciating a certain body type by doing this. All right, I, I want to say body that, types. Right. I don't think there's 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 no <clears throat> body type that's like wrong, right? People come in all shapes and sizes, and if Nintendo chose to make a woman with big breasts in their game then that isn't a, a window for the community to just be like, holy crap, like, look at those breasts. That's all I care about, and I want to objectify that and all that. It's it's like, just just kind of be a decent person and just be like, oh, okay, yeah, they, they gave this person big boobs. Fine. Move along, right? Like, like, why make that, like, a crazy focus? It's a thing I talk about on stream a lot, which uh, I, I joke about here and there, uh, about not yucking people's yums and the phrase is it's a silly phrase meant to say like hey whatever you're into as long as it doesn't harm other people yeah it, yo that's not it, right? this mod isn't harming anybody dog it's not people can look back at this bro i've seen so many people on twitter just laugh at it because it's funny it's a joke it's funny it's nothing really it's nothing really to make either hurt anybody or harm anybody disrespect anybody i look at this as a simple joke when i saw it on twitter i saw this actually i saw this on youtube maybe like a few minutes ago and i'm like oh okay this is okay somebody did this that's funny okay and just kept it pushing i did bro i, I didn't um, think i never thought that, somebody would make it i don't care if you're i keep pausing it's just I'm sorry. your thing if it's harmful to people like pedophilia then uh, fuck that right you don't get to do that uh, but other things like you're you're into you're into hentai. Okay, fine. Some some people's yums uh, does border on the kind of weird. It's like right on the edge of actually being harmful towards people, right? And even that stuff, like you could enjoy it in the privacy of your own room, right? Like you could even you could even put it on a banner, right, on on your Twitter account. There's ways in which you you know you, you have your your things that you're into, and then there's ways that you either keep them to yourself or like put them out there on a case by case basis some are okay some are not i think one that i is feel like this okay. falls in that same category though i feel like this kind of falls in the same category i don't think it's that much of a big deal i really don't it's not like he stripped them out of the, he stripped them out of their freaking clothes and put them in the game now it put him in the game. Now that is kind of pushing it. it, it say if he sh like stripped them out of their like their their uh, costumes or clothing or whatever, and made them fight that way. Then yes, that's kind of pushing the envelope a little bit. But dog, the video was like eight seconds long. It's not like he made a full that thirty minute video. That kind of does cross that line. Is making a fucking video game mod like? Why do you, why do you have to make? 
You don't think, hey, 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 time out. All right, tell me this, though. You don't think Nintendo, Nintendo knew exactly what they were doing when they were making these characters. You don't think they had the same pros. Like, oh, man, fan service. That's what it's called, fan service. That's what they were doing, adding fan service. You don't think Nintendo knew what they were doing. How about, uh, how about an anime? An anime, freaking fairy tale, Lucy, Erza. Yeah, I mean, people who watch fairy tale know what I'm talking about. It's fan service. You don't think Nintendo knew what they were doing when they were when they were creating prior Mithra? Mithra, I, I know I put I've been pronouncing name for like for a long time anyway. But you know, how about the people who made Sino Blaze Chronicles? They made them thick for a reason. You think Nintendo? Come, yo, Nintendo's a is a you know what I mean kind of company. If you catch my drift, you feel me? Mod specifically so that the boobs can jiggle in the game. It just it makes no sense to me. Like. Are you not playing Smash because you like playing the game of Smash? I'm pretty Tell sure this guy that enjoys needs to game. turn into your fetish getting put out there. Like, okay, you're into boob physics, then do that shit on your own. I don't know why you need to see this game that you play, this the Smash Brothers, and then you need to morph it into a new version so that the boobs jiggle <laughs> for your pleasure. It's just the that's that's the kind of thing I'm talking about. It's like you got your you got your yums. And you're just allowing it to to cross that line where you just have to broadcast it. You have Yo, to just bring out. it into other but, places. But how about all the other, how about all the freaking weirdos and crap like that that's going on? In the, you don't talk about that. You don't make a video about that. But you're making a video about stupid physics, jiggle physics, dog? Seriously? What about all the other crap that's going on in the Nintendo community, dog? How about that? How about all the shady crap that goes around and around that? But this is important. The stuff like this. You're worrying about this? What about all the weird stuff that's been going on around Nintendo? How about that, huh? We don't talk about that, right? But we talk about this. That. that Bro, like, the game of Smash doesn't exist for that. And I don't know why. Dude, people feel it's just do fun. That. And, like I said, I guess it just might be your thing. Honestly, I think there's a lot of. A lot of benefit of keeping some of that private, at least to some extent, right? If you're like into like Ahegao and you got all kinds of hoodies in your closet, well then, if I really wanted to see those hoodies, I'd ask you, yo, let me let me see those hoodies, right? But like, it's when it's when you put it out there to an extreme degree that like no one's really asking for. It. It's like the edgier stuff that people are choosing to like put out there that I have a problem with. The what uh, makes this particular edgy is like, dude, let's let's be you, real here. Wow. Smash is a video game typically meant for children. What about all the it's other games game people this play game. for fun? And it, a lot of the audience is young, impressionable people. So why bring your boob jiggle fetish to that arena? Why do it there? Keep it in your fucking room, dude. <laughs> and like, the main point... That a lot is, I think somebody even said it on on one of the tweets. Let me actually pull that up. Ah, here we go. Okay. Disappointed to see so many people in the replies defending this, like it's not super weird. Weird's relative, but like I said, uh, there's there are things that are just right on that borderline that I think need to be kept to yourself. But uh, then it says, uh, if, I'm guessing what they meant to say was, if it doesn't hurt anyone, let them be. And then uh, similar here. How is this annoying? And then they say, like, it's just people saying, like, oh, it's not bothering people. Here, like, it's not in the actual game. It's just a fucking mod. If you don't like it, if you don't want your kids to see it, don't download it. Okay. And you're saying, well, if you're not into it, don't download it. Don't worry about it. Okay. Here are the facts, right? If tournaments come back, do you right? actually think someone's not going to bring their modded Switch to a tournament with the boob physics to play it there in person? It's probably going to be a tournament setup, and the, the tournament organizer might not even realize that it's there. And so people are playing it. Some 22-year-old, like, Bro, ogling. nobody's going to be paying any mind anyway. You can't, you, like, bro, you really think people are going to sit up in that, to and sit up in that stage, sit up in, like, the chairs and just pay attention to this, that? They're going to pay attention to, to the people that are fighting. They're not going to pay attention to just that. For what, bro? People probably not even gonna peep it because all the because all the action, all the mayhem that's going on on the freaking screen, dog. 
you got so you got fucking small. You got, you got people watching, bro. I highly doubt people are going to pay attention to to, to strict uh, to strictly just that, dog. I'm sorry. Yeah, just laughing and cracking up about it, and then like a a girl is in the vicinity, and she she just sees all these dudes like just just going nuts over this jiggle physic mod that some dude decided to make for whatever reason and then now that girl has to feel uncomfortable because she has boobs and then these people are ogling at that character so what what in her mind would make her think that they're not gonna do the same thing with her maybe they won't show it but what's what's the separation there and if you really think that that the world is so good at separating the fiction side from real people then you're out of your mind like i said earlier Hmm. This type of thing already happens to real people, and it's because of the culture. So if this is happening at a real event, that's a way in this in which this could be harmful to people. Let's say you're a woman in the in the community, and just knowing that a ton of people are downloading this 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 weirdo thing and enjoying it publicly and talking about it, and like, how do they feel knowing that there's Dog. that many members of the community who are just down me. to not play Smash? The normal way, but to play Smash with the boob physics because that's Bro, what they prefer. It's a little, yo. It's a like little. You have to understand how that would make that someone I feel. Someone who doubt relates to those characters and what you're, attention what you're to. making of them when you people play probably them. thought it was already. Um, Bro, say if somebody so yeah, so didn't this, this see whole this, thing, right? Uh, they probably would think this. People probably thought it probably. If, uh, <laughs> People probably thought this would be already in the game. If you're not a guy who's not really invested in the Smash and you're just picking up the game and people probably saw that, they'll probably be like, oh, dang, this is in the game. They probably wouldn't even realize it's a freaking mod, bro. Uh, if you don't like it, don't download it. It's bullshit. Here's a, a big point that I also want to make. They're, they're saying something like, okay, this is a common response. It's like people were totally fine with like shirtless Shulk. Shirtless Sephiroth with the six pack abs and all of that. Why is this such a big deal? I, I I think I have a very easy way to explain that. Context matters a lot. Context matters a ton. There right. is a huge difference in the way that women are treated in society for their bodies versus men. And if women are constantly um, valued based on their bodies in society or devalued because of their bodies in society, then a uh, Promoting that kind of action in society is what makes that more wrong than doing it with a man. A man is not necessarily uh, valued yeah, by their animals. body and by society the same way. So if you take a, a picture of shirtless Sephiroth and you talk about his abs being the sickest washboard abs that anybody has ever seen, uh, it it's a lot less hurtful. Because I I mean I'm I'll say it as a man I don't I don't feel objectified. Ever, because society doesn't really do that to me. If society were to change and it happens all the time and I start to realize that people only value me for the way that I look, then of course eventually I'm going to have a problem with the type of uh, culture that perpetuates that. So you have to put yourself into the shoes of women and understand that this is the life that they live every single day. So when they go online, Yo, they go I to cannot a community that's supposed to be an escape, really just playing just video games, right? And then about this. people are still doing over this. Even there, it's like clip. there's no fucking escape. How long was that clip? It's a shitty it? feeling. And there's a big difference between people saying that about Sephiroth or Shulk it's a versus doing it yet again second. on uh, female characters, right? So that's one big difference. Uh, and then the other part, when I say context matters, this is a big one. How about we understand that Smash went through a lot of shit in the summer uh, in regards to sexual harassment uh, Talk assault. about that. Um, That's the real and, issue. Uh, That's the real issue that, that you're talking about. Probably Yo, if you were making way better, oh my gosh, bro, if we, you were making a like, video about if, that, if there's and some kind of shitty standard that already exists that makes some of these things okay, about this. we need to be this is a waste of time. We need to get ahead of time because we're like we already went through the the consequences. Of the way we were behaving already. So why would we continue that behavior? We need to be better, right? That maybe this is not the place to make a mod with jiggle physics on the boobs of the characters. Right? You see what I'm saying? That's that's probably that's probably where your head should be at. So yeah, just don't be dumb on the internet. Like just just all you need to do is think for more than like two seconds and stop with these like very 
bottom line basic arguments of like, oh, but you can't do it to guys, or oh, well, it's just a fictional character; it's not real people. Like all I those say none of those arguments things. are I trash. Say none like of it's that. just people that uh, either uh, truly just do not want to think one layer deeper. Or being disingenuous and no, just like right, to be trolls I'm online. I'm all for thinking deep. I think deep about everything. But when I first saw this, that that did not. I would never. I would never, ever hop on camera and make a 14 minute freaking video over a 20 second, 27 second long clip over this. If it was something like yo, I could understand making a video about some shit that happened with uh. With the with the freaking word that's going on with the Smash community, but how that girl went went out with the, with, with that freaking twelve year old kid, that thirteen year old young boy or something like that, well, you know, back back way back in the Smash community type beat, and Bull came out on Twitter and started saying, "Yo, that's something to make a video about." How about that? What well, about bro? Nintendo has been getting bashed over this kind of stuff, over the whole freaking weirdo stuff that's been going. On. I don't want to see the. I don't want to say that word, but yo, but talk. That's something worth worth making a fourteen minute clip of. But over a 27-second long clip over something stupid and little, you got to be kidding me, dog. You know, I, this is small stuff, bro. There's way more important stuff that's going on. If you, if, if, since you want to put real-life comparisons into this kind of stuff, there's so much more real-life crap going on over this stupid 27-second long clip, hugs. Real rap, bro. There's a whole lot of bad stuff going on in the Nintendo community, but you're over worried about this. You're worried about that over the, all the crap that's going on. Since you like bringing in the world, like real life world issues into into video games, what about all the stuff that's going on in the real world? We, how about you talk about that? That that's that's a topic. That's worth talking about. Not this stupid stuff. Come on, man. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done.